Dennis Barrett. It's got a big what? Sun cream in the middle of his nose. Turtle looks very sunburned already. I already put sunscreen on. On your neck? Yeah. <laughs> Look at his neck. <laughs> Biden. Let's do it. Let's do it. Are we at the top yet, Danny? Huh? Are we at the top? The only place I've ever nearly stood on a coastal Taipan was that island just there. Yeah. Baby one. Hey, look at the current line. Is that where the tuna were or further? Oh, just down here, right? Yeah. Oh, damn. It looks really fishy. It's beautiful. Look at those big bombies. Yeah. They're hanging around there, man. And that ledge looks sick, too. Hundred and thirty pound P ten, two twenty pound liter. My lossy skitsy diving popper. Two BKKs on it. That looks mental. So the boys are about to be on. Oh Baden swap, swap, swaps. Go on the oysters, the oysters will be good. All right, let's all go to that next zone. Seriously, if there's a GT there, he would've come up. Let's go to this little area here on the left and then maybe pepper with the mediums. Nothing. Yes! Oh, bro! Big! What do you reckon? Is that a G? It's going down, bro. Oi, 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 oi. 50 pounds. Um, run. I think run. Keep your tip up as high as you can, run. Run out there. Smoke it up. If it's a G, smoke it. It looks like a G the way it's going deep. Oh, oh, oh. Does it feel G-ish? Can't tell. Oh, there's no like beats. I'm... Oh, it's solid! Baden. <laughs> it looks deep is the scary thing. What do you got? It's really big. I think it could be like a really big mackerel. What'd you hook it on? Little X rat. X -rat. Oh, don't chill. Don't chill. How, what? Don't lock it. Don't lock it either, though. But do you know what your drag was on? Yeah, it's on like pretty right. Oh. oh. Woo! Woo! Holy sh! GT. Oh, I think that could have been a G the way it was going down and down and down. I think I've still got my lure though. Are that you serious? That was huge. Yeah, no, it's not. Gone. That was a... I think that could have been a GT. It was a turtle. It was not, was that? <laughs> gone. Later gone. Oh, yeah. Well... Big. Yeah. What do you got, bro? Big, big GT. You on a G? Yeah. Yeah, bro, come on. <clears throat> Keep pressure, you might have to run. Just watch where he is, oh God. Yeah, he's going right, you're good. You're good. Not yet, don't put it in there yet. You can use it now if you want it. Focus and smoke him up now while he's out in the safe zone. Lots oh, of pressure, no. lots of pressure, bro. No. Keep your tip up, keep your tip up. Just keep your tip up. Run this way. Tip up, keep your pressure on. Yes! 
Biden! Biden! Get the pressure on, he's turning. You've been touched off of it. Okay. Oh. Oh. What have you got? Watch out, Ray, you might have to run there. Run, run, run. Loose him off if you need to. A bit, like, keep pressure up, keep bringing him up. You might have to run here. Oh, oh no. Smoke him now. Lock up and smoke him. Just go crazy, bro. Try and get his belt down a bit. Yeah. Go, 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 go. You've got this. Keep bringing him. Big G. Big GT. Shark on him. Shark on him. Black GT. Yes. Woo. Good. Easy over 20 kilo. Yeah. Hit. Grab him and put your arm so your hands up it under his bum and your elbow goes under like that. Yes. Woo! Oh, rotate this way. Yes, that's solid, man. You want to do a water release? Yeah. Okay. One sec, one sec. You grab the tail and just rest him down. We should have had the camera on Biden the whole time. I was just screaming out to you. That Try and man. save your leader here. Yeah. If you can. Yep. Watch out, Yeah, okay. No, I've never caught a black one. I've never caught a black one. I've always wanted a black one. You get one first. First pop. Okay. That was amazing. Woo! First fish of the trip. Good 20 plus kilo GT for Biden. Yep. Oh, long Tom. Longy. Not the right type of longy. It went mental. <laughs> First hit of the trip felt good. Me and the tail are on the longies. We're just changing ledge because the currents changed direction. And right here looks pretty pressure pointy to us. It's not real strong at the moment. <clears throat> so we don't, we don't actually know if this is going to be the best spot or where we were, but on this side is going to be the best spot. Such a nice ledge to spin though. The only thing that would make this better is sun, but the conditions are sick. So calm. So calm. What are we going to see me then if we don't get a tuna? I really want you to see me. 100% gonna get a tuna with all that tuna action we've seen today. 100. 1,000. He's so confident, that. He just barred everything we threw at him and he's like, yeah, 1,000% we'll get one. I reckon they didn't see my lure. Metal's not always the best for tunies. Am I rolling? Yeah, 37 seconds. Amazing. I have a few props. That's a J, bro. Big. Did you see its shoulders? Did you see the shoulders on that?
Grab the other one, yeah. Oh, can you lick it? Or maybe use your camera. There we go. I think he's pretty big. Gee, he took a run and a half. I haven't had a big fish for a couple years, Tammy. At least a year. Get him. I'm trying, there's rocks here. Can you keep an eye on him and... Boy, I think it might be a shark. No. No head shake. No. It could be a big shark. It's GT. Is it? Big in GT. He's in the current. It's a big GT. Oh, turned. Oh, God. Big fish. Oh, God. I... Where is he? Quick, quick, quick. Oh, he's on rock. Big shark. It's a shark. Big shark. Is it a shark? I'm on rock. Unless it's a shark on it, no. Oh, big shark. Oh, boys. This is gnarly. Where are those deep hookers? Oh, he's going to cut Oh, big shark. I was going to say water release. <sighs> I was going to say that's a lot heavier than a, like if that was a G, it was going to be that like a hundred kilo. That first run was amazing. <sighs> Crazy. What happened, man? Well, shark ate what was for about two seconds my favourite popper. And my favourite popper is now with a shark. You know what happened? He turned, the line went through his teeth. I could feel it rubbing. Oh, I got smoked. I thought shark, cause there wasn't any, it was just dead weight, big dead weight. Thank you. Good on you mate. Bloody hell. That was my favorite lure ever. Did you see the pops on that thing? Yeah. Of the inside of my leg. Buy your undies. No, it's like, well, if I bar it, it's still gonna think it's gonna get worse. Really? I don't ever wear undies. No chafee. No chafee? Thumper thighs, eh? No, can't. I think JT. Big one. Boys, am I about to get smoked on that ledge? I turned it. I turned it. Come on. Far out. Come up. Oh no, the ledge. Timmy. Daddy, I can't do anything. <laughs> Oh, he keeps turning back and forth. There he is. Woo! I only grabbed the leader. Yeah, boys! Yes! Perfect. I've got a little remora. Maybe, maybe chuck the remora back because he'll get lost in the abyss of land. Two of those poppers. This is a diving one. Oh, right. Um, yeah. Is there a pool? It's just a baby compared to your one. Well done. Still got a G though. Woo! I thought it was a bit bigger than that. 
Did you see how mental I was going? <laughs> Woo! About 15 kilo JT. Just a little grunter. Frothing though. Couldn't see a thing. Okay. <laughs> It headbutted me in the shit. It came off. Gone. Oh, so this is Baden's setup that he was using. That's his reel. Saltiga 6500H, where he got that big 20 kilo plus GT. He's using the Melocity Lure. But this rod, Saltiga X802S 8 to 10, was Briggs's rod, loner rod for Baden. But since he got his first ever GT on it, it's now your rod, mate. Cheers, legend. Frothing. Frothing, absolutely frothing. You can come JT fishing anytime now. Yeah. Cheers. All right, that's an end to epic first day. I got a little 15 kilo. Baden got the 20 plus. Timmy's got two trout on his hip. Timmy's providing dinner tonight. I'm frothing on that. Definitely check out Timmy's new channel. Only if you're a good sub. If you're a bad sub, don't. Do I have bad subs? Yes, I do. I'm not even going to tell them. Briggs is having one more cast, Timmy. Can you wait? Just one more. I'll come behind us. You go. I'll come in like 10 minutes. Just to give you an idea of how far the walk is from camp to the ledge. That's the ledge that we're spinning and the other side today. Big walkie all the way over mountains. Big mountains, going whole way back to camp. That's the boat you see, way over there in the distance. I reckon it's about five kilometers. I reckon it's about a 5K walk and these hills are gnarly. So soft, like what you're walking in is just gnarly soft with little rocks underneath. Can you make it up there? Fruity? Ooh, that's a weird, weird snaky hole. I'm charging it. Oh, it's so shaly. Oh, I don't think this is good. <laughs> Very weird zone. That's not doable. Brings him up. Perish, yeah? Oh, I'm up. I'm up. Look at that sunset. Look what I just came up. Death. Straight death. Oh. Look at that sunset though. Oh my God. Am I even making it back to camp this way? I thought I was taking the shortcut by low lining, but it's just mental cliffs. Don't really know what to do. I'm walking a little shaly tightrope. Oh, no go, definite no go. Oh my God, I'm standing on like broken rock. I think we're good. Oh, very slippery, very slippery. Bridge is sliding. That feels good to be <laughs> past the vertical. Oh my God, look at the sunset. Look at the sunset now. <sighs> now I can low line, but it's good to know you fully can't go that way. If I had rods with me, I wouldn't be able to do it. Left the rods at the ledge, because no one's on the island. And <clears throat> we're going straight there first thing in the morning. Knees aren't what they used to be. But go all right for a 40 year old. Briggsy 37, definitely getting older. Oh my God. Oh my God, look at this sunset. What a way to finish out the day. We had to anchor here because we've got a massive boat and it's all reef near the tip. So we didn't want to anchor in the reef. We've got sand anchors and a massive boat that we <laughs> have to take care of. It's our only way back home. <laughs> oh, that's a weird noise. Frogs. There was a frog here somewhere. A frog in a rock. 
There's frogs in these rocks. It's salt water. Salt water frog. Is that a thing? If you want to see Timmy's coral trap from today, check out Timmy Turtle Fish and look for the coral trap video. It'll be catch and cook coral trap with a beautiful drone shot because he just flew his drone overhead. So you'll see that same sunset in his video. All right, everyone. Have a good one.